Ricky Balbi, uh, please take the stand. So you're you're saying that I uh, shot you in the back twice when there was only one cartridge from my gun fired and recovered there. I heard two shots. The first shot was uh, the gun. The second shot was the objection being deployed. Two shots. Was your, your objection? It doesn't matter how many times he was shot with a lethal. The point is that he used a lethal to initiate. Yeah, let's move on from uh, how many times you were shot, and we understand that the uh, witness, that the prosecution was plaintiff. The plaintiff, thank you, was uh, shot by the officer at least once. We understand that it was with a lethal weapon. We can move on from All that. Right. So, so, why did you not stop when I told you to to stop? For one, why should I stop when I was in the wrong? He just admitted to he was what? in the wrong? Yeah, he said, uh, could you repeat that again, please? I said, why should I stop when I wasn't in the wrong? I didn't mm -hmm. do nothing wrong other than kick your dog because he pissed on my shoe for self-defense. I don't want his well, fucking you, urine you could have stopped and told me what was going on. All I saw was you kick the dog and trying to continuously go after the dog. I mean, first of all, I didn't know. Like, can you know, everyone go on show? It's not like he has a police uniform on, okay? So, I mean... Listen... I didn't put the outfit on the dog. The dog was handed off to me probably about, I don't know, 12 hours before that incident happened. Ricky, are officer. you on show? No. And, uh, well, anyway, pa past that, after I uh, tased you the first time, why did you not stay down? Why did you get up and start tasing me? Because you shot me with a gun. I thought it was self-defense. Oh, you could have, like, not tased several times. Once I tased you once, that was heck, it. Heck, even when you put out your gun, I said, don't shoot, don't shoot, and you shot me. You didn't I say ran away. I, I ran away from that, and you still shot me. So my own self-defense, when you tased me and I got back up, I tased you back. I, less lethal. Didn't kill you. A little stun, that's all. And then that's yeah. when I started kicking you. I wanted to try to get away from you. You ran into a back room and came back personally. out swinging. I didn't run into a back room. You ran into a back room. No, I did not. That's when I started trying to pull out my baton and you continued no, you to punch me as I was trying to pull out. out my baton. You got up and pulled out the baton and started whacking me with it. And so I went down and he said stop resisting when I was already down. Were the uh, cameras rolling inside that uh, car dealership? Do you know? Uh, I was sorry to speak out of turn. I was the owner there at PDM, and uh, we were having a outage on our camera CCTV system at the time. Heck, not only that, but about two people saw what happened. Saw everything that happened. We'll get to that, Bobby. Just can I can I get a an objection to uh, the defense for uh, some of the evidence provided? What is your objection? He's leading and badgering the witness. Uh, currently, he's trying to get the evidence. What are you uh, trying to do with the evidence? Beforehand. Yes. yes. Uh, what are you trying to do with the witness? Uh, I'm just trying to get the evidence of uh, how many taser deploys were actually done. Uh, and. Baggy the taser prongs. All right, go ahead and uh, count them out for us. Where are we going with these uh, taser prongs? I just want to show how many times that uh, I hit him with taser and how many I had missed. And uh, how many he he had uh, tased me with and how many he had missed. Go ahead and hand him over. All right. In the meantime, do you have any more questions for the witness? In the meantime, no, I don't have any other questions. Right. 
can't even fucking. Uh, right here it says, uh, officer. Well, <clears throat> at the time, really, I think you were acting chief or whatever. Acting God damn. Buddy deployed his taser three times, which was a total of six prongs. And uh, you connected with two of those prongs. Yeah, uh, with the uh, suspect. Why don't you speak up some? Are you able? Yeah, there we go. I'm shouting now. So uh, it said Acting Chief Buddy deployed his cha taser three times, and two of those, and that's six prongs. Two of those prongs connected with Ricky Bobby. And then it said uh, Ricky Bobby deployed his taser. One second. Five times, and that's ten taser prongs. And all of those, all five shots connected to Officer Buddy while he was, he tased him multiple times while he was down. Is that all, Assistant Sheriff? Yeah, that's all that I have. Thank you very much. What's Ricky the... Bobby, you may step down. Awkward. 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 Thank you. There's a bug. Uh -huh. Prosecution, would you like to? Would you like to call your first witness? We already called our first witness. Who was that? That was Ricky Bobby. Oh, well, Ricky Bobby is your client. You need, I'm talking. Uh, oh, you want to call a witness? Wit witness, witness, yes. <laughs> Not the person that got. What's, that it the, happened to. what's the guy in the white's name? Trevor. Trevor? Yes, sir. Yep. Yep. Will you step up? Yeah, excuse me, officer. Thank you. So you were there at PDM that evening, correct? Correct, yeah, I'm the owner of the dealership there. Okay. And what uh, what's your connection to Ricky Bobby and Officer Buddy, might I ask? Um, uh, other than Officer Buddy being a officer and a customer of mine, that's the only connection. And then Ricky Bobby is also a customer of mine. So he's just a customer that comes in regularly, pays bills? Correct, yeah, he comes in, pays on his financing vehicles, look at our new stock, just usual stuff. And would you say he's a model citizen? Um, yeah, yes. Other than his bad driving, I'd say he's uh, a I mean, pretty model citizen. Everyone's got a little bit of bad driving, but because he pays bills on time. Correct, yeah. Okay. And uh, how many dealings with Officer Buddy have you had? Um, I've had a few. Okay. Yeah, he's came in and bought a few cars from either okay. me or my other salesman. Has he ever been aggressive toward you? Nope. No question. Okay. Have you ever been on a traffic stop by officer, but I believe once. Yes, once. So you don't have a good judge of his character, you would say? Um, I mean, so during the few times he's came in to buy a car, it's been just it like any other time anybody comes in and buys a car, and then on kind the traffic of stop. Yeah, he okay. let me off with a uh, warning, so I mean, he's on, pretty laid back. And then on the incident that we're referring to in the court case. What was his temperament? Let me ask you. Um, so when he showed up with the K9 unit, um, I'd say it was just like uh, any other day. I mean, it's any other time I've seen him, it's been the same. So he was mellow. Yeah, I'd say so. Laid back. Home. And when Mr. Bobby kicked the dog to get get it to stop peeing on him, what was uh, Officer Buddy's reaction? Um, I'd say his first reaction was uh, to protect his fellow law enforcement, even though it was a canine unit. I would say it was an adequate response to uh, protect. Yeah, I was that fight or flight. Like he instantly ran over there to try to figure out what was going on. And did you hear a gunshot from a pistol? I did. Did you hear what kind of pistol it may have been? Was, did uh, it sound like a service pistol? Um, yeah, it sounded, st st sounded just like a, a standard pistol. Standard, yeah. standard Beretta 9 millimeter. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, I have the uh, exact pistol if you would like. You have the round. Uh, the it was a nine millimeter from a heavy pistol. Oh, so it was the E357. Uh, yes. Heavy round. Yes. Okay. So it was from a 357, so it was probably a little... I don't know if you have the ear pack on. 
But so he shot him with a three fifty seven, ladies and gentlemen, as you that can do some damage. Luckily it only went through his arm. Did also, Mr. Bob objection, it went through his back, not his arm. Uh I was told arm. Alright, well the bullet was pulled out of his back during surgery. And, I uh, did see the bullet go. 